Hello everyone, welcome to jobskillshare.org, continuing our playlist on Job Skills Share. If you go to YouTube, search, click on playlist, and then click on IT Career 2019 videos, I am going to add this video. And this video is related to this question, which is a pretty cool question. So let's go ahead and actually look into that question. And that is studying for my Security Plus right now. Do you think I will be able to get a help desk job with it? Is it good to get A plus after I heard if you have security plus then A plus doesn't worth whatever you know so then I, I basically replied that yes you're 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 right you heard it correctly if you have a security plus in terms of getting a job I mean getting a job in terms of that impression what how other people look into the certification in terms of that you are right in terms of actual learning then that's they may not be right because security plus uh, certification may not be designed for a help desk or support type of positions it is designed for that security side of it but basically what happens right now in reality if i show you if i take you to the real world right now and if we look into the help desk technician one most of the jobs basically will have something like this as you can see in front of the screen it says preferred but not required almost all of 80 percent of these jobs either they won't even won't, they won't even put something like that and if they do put certifications they usually say preferred you know or something like that if they do must then that specific position may be a security position and they usually put must in that if it's a help desk position and that's a government level position where they really want you to get the certificate and then you can get in they will put must in there but that's very rare for a for a IT job like entry level jobs they don't put must in there most of the time but you can see there's so many preferred in there you even if you put our platform you have a help desk support technician uh, certificate that will also be a valid certificate because it's it's it comes into that you know that's how other people are looking into these like they want something they want something different or they want something some type of maybe certification to just just that you did something a little more than other person who who basically went to a college and just straight out came out of the college and have uh, nothing no no certification or no uh, you know a little bit like a real world type of training and that really matters um, so that that should answer your question look at this like you know like i said most of the people will put a plus network plus security plus mta mca i mean people will put a lot of things but anything above a plus can basically do it for you you don't have to actually go for a plus to finish it but i actually i actually mentioned in my comment you should still learn the content of a plus now you don't have to actually go to a school for that you don't have to actually sit in some type of boot camp or you know you don't even have to pay any other site even our site you don't have to pay for anything you can actually go to professormesser.com which is by far the most professional video i have ever seen on internet so far completed i will say complete internet complete certification videos so if you're interested in like learning the content then i would definitely recommend you go to uh, comptia a plus on professormesser.com and actually start learning from this if you're interested in that now our way of doing is a little different you know we tell people that don't invest too much time in and get stuck into the certification learning because that never ends for most of us right we, we never go to a, a certification we don't go to pass exams and we spend that all that time and then when you learn and the certification is just your your whole your whole uh, you know end goal is to pass the certification you never thought of that real world scenarios real world situation real world interviews so we did a little bit different in our in our platform when people come to a platform we base our courses based on titles so this is a free course and has more than 13,000 people right now and you see it says help us entry level to specialist so we teach so much of reality and so many of different type of real world skills that you get job ready basically so you get job ready first you land a job and once you land a job you still come over here you learn that advanced skills while if you think that you're missing something or you don't know the terminology the theoretical side of uh, it or maybe you don't you need to learn a little bit more about what is this what is the like what is the the 
technology behind it what is the definition of something then you may want to go back to certification and then click on one of these videos but they're free too you know you can always come back and and just take this and just get your learning make your base a little bit more uh, informative I would say you know but in in real world this is what you're going to need you're going to need something like uh, you know imaging deploying troubleshooting things like uh, uh, third-party softwares that are known to the whole world like Spiceworks everybody every most of the IT person uh, like if you tell them a system administrator or a help desk technician technicians there are millions of people using Spiceworks and yet we, they won't teach that in the certification because it's a third party I mean it's, it has nothing to do with uh, a plus so I don't know if they're doing it right now but most of the time that is what may that that is what will give you points when you go to the interview you know so and that's why our courses are designed like active directory user uh, management is a very famous course and even our videos the top videos are about active directory and some people even say that because of this video i landed a job and that's how it is in an active directory so many people will ask you questions about active directory ticketing systems when i started this certification when i started this whole course there was no nobody was talking about ticketing systems there, there was nothing in a plus None of these certifications, even colleges, nobody had anything about uh, ticketing. And all of a sudden now you see ServiceNow and Remedy, these are the top. Now everybody will ask you in that question because everybody uses this, these type of tools. And that's kind of like your job, uh, most of us. And then Office 365. So we make our courses to help you in a real world. But you can also go back to these sites where you can actually learn something more theory but let's say for example you want to be in our platform you're a premium member we also give you the ability to do that we give you 241 courses in that a plus is included programming is included servers mcsa whatever you name it it's, it's included in these courses so you can come and invest a little bit of money and then you can get these if you think that you want practical then we have so many labs now when i say lab it's actually a lab course so let's say, for example, you are interested in Cisco, then you have a whole career in front of you right here. If you think you you're, you want to do A plus from here practically by going to, let's say you're doing a combination over here. You like Professor Messer, you do some videos, you learn those skills, then you go back to Job Skills Share, try to get this certificate so it looks good on your resume. Then you come back to the practice lab and actually do the whole lab. When I say a whole lab, it is a 40 hours content right there. So it's a lot of like labs in just one module to learn a lot of things. And on top of this, we made videos for you for these labs. So you, you are also learning on the go or if you have a phone or something like that. So this platform is, is designed not just a learning management system. It's not, we're not, a com we're not like a Udemy or Pluralsight. We're, we're not that, you know, we don't put courses and courses and courses. We put courses to help a title. That is a very different thing than just putting a course and t giving it to someone. We are kind of advisors. So we will pick anything that is most important for you to land a job, perform better at your job, and then move up in your IT career. That is our main goal. That's what we do in, our, in this platform. So uh, back to the main question. If you have Security Plus, if you have Network Plus, and anything above MCSA, anything above you don't really need to go for an actual certification for a plus forget about that if you have those they, those are considered a little highly rated but again my main uh, point in this video is that everything that i showed you so far you're going to need the combination of this to determine or learn the skills that you will need landing a job be performing better at your job so you're stress-free and then moving up in your job the smart way not the hard way that will be my uh, main video for today if you have any questions about this video then let me know I know this is a lot of stuff for someone uh, I mean I know I can I can move around these things very easily and that's what we do in jobs could share when you become a plus or premium member you send us an email and then we basically help you out too to you know okay you need to take this course you need to take this course uh okay you know you have an interview coming soon let's just take uh, a lab video from here we'll give you specific sections maybe we'll look into the description of that job and say i think this company is really focused on imaging so you should take this module this module and this module that's how we help people so hopefully you like this video let me know if you want to see more videos like this and i will see you in my other videos thank you